Hello everyone, I wanted to talk to you about our summer training program that we've set up um, kind of in lieu of the, the our summer camp. Um, this is a completely optional um, program um, for every player. Uh, it's set up throughout the whole club, um, but it's a completely optional play, uh, program if players want to participate um, and if they want something to do on a day. Um, we've set up different activities for them to, to complete um, based on the age group that they're in. So what I wanted to do today was show you exactly how you go about finding those programs using the, the play metric system um, that we have in place now. Um, one of the cool things about it is that we're able to input different exercises to, for a practice, let's say, but give uh, players the, the chance to see those activities. And I wanted to show you how to do that this uh, today. Okay, so when you go into your play metrics account and this is obviously from your desktop but it's or, or your laptop uh, or possibly your your uh, tablet um, but it, kind of the same process through your mobile device as well um, when you come in uh, you'll see into your your player contact um, dashboard uh, then you'll you'll have if you've got multiple kids you'll have different teams to choose from like this if not you'll have your one team um, and you'll kind of see the calendar for the week as well um, so we've got things set up from June 1st all the way through the beginning of July. Um, and the way you go about kind of seeing what um, the kids can do that each day, um, if you wanted to, you could click on your your player's team. You go can just go look at my upcoming events, um, and you would click right on the, the word practice here. Now when you click on that, you'll see a list of exercises for them to take part in um, and then on that if you click on the individual titles to the names so if I was to click on toe taps right here it will take me in and give me the instructions and then one of the cool things that we've also got available to us with the play metric system um, with some of their kind of built-in exercises there are videos that go along with it so if I need to know what toe taps look like, I can click on those videos, right? And I can watch, right? And we can see what they're doing, right? Pretty cool system. So again, we'll just go back through it quick. I go into my player contact window um, and then I would find my player's team. Um, again, I could just use this calendar that's already here. Uh, but if I wanted to go into their team, I click on the title, so click on practice. That'll open up the window that should show us everything that's listed for that day that the kids can do. And then I can click on the individual exercise to get the description, the layout, and possibly a video as well. Now some things have videos, some things don't, um, but we tried our best as possible to to make sure that anything that we put in um, had a good enough description on it and eventually we'll be trying to add as many videos as possible to it. But again, that's our summer training program. And again, it is a completely optional thing. We It's not expected um, that you participate. It's not a requirement, um, but it's something that we wanted to put together um, and we'll continue to put together for years to come. Um, kind of this year, based out of the fact that we didn't have camp, but um, in, in discussion, something that we want to put out there for everyone as is. Um, so I hope that this video helps you navigate through finding out how to do things each day. Um, and then if you have any questions, please let me know. Um, you've got my contact information over here. So I would be more than happy to help you out. Um, I know it's a transition moving into a new system. But again, fairly simple. All right. I hope you have a good day.